Welcome back. Prime Minister Mustafa Medbouli stressed that the state gives great attention to small, medium and micro-sized projects, referring to several initiatives that support these projects in the line with President Al-Fatah Sisi's directives to provide job opportunities for the youth. This came during the Premier's meeting with the Minister of Finance, Mohamed Ma'it. The guidelines include means of increasing the SME's revenues and capitalizing on advantages and privileges given to them in contracts with administrative bodies. On his part, the Minister of Finance said that the Ministry prepared uh, this guide and made it available on its website. Commander of the Egyptian Navy Forces Vice Admiral Ahmed Khalid said that Egypt has a strong naval forces uh, with high efficiency which support the naval security and stability of the region. This came during a press conference held by the Naval Conference's commander marking the 54th anniversary since its foundation on the 21st of October 1967. On that day, the Israeli destroyer Ilet sank tanks to the naval forces that were the first to launch a rocket naval battle, a battle that amazed the entire world. The first integrated plasma collection center in Africa and the Middle East was inaugurated on the 6th of October city in cooperation between the armed forces and the Spanish company Griffles. The project aims at supporting the health care system in Egypt through the establishment of 20 plasma donation centers and a factory for plasma uh, drugs production in accordance with the latest international standards in this field. The project comes in framework of the armed forces efforts to support and develop the medical system according to the latest scientific fields. Foreign Minister Samah Shukri met on Thursday with the head of the Libya's unity government and uh, Abdul Hamid, Abdul Hamid de Beba and the meeting was held on the sidelines of Shukri's participation in the conference held by Libya's unity government to shore up support and transitional issues on the country gears up for presidential December election. Speaking at the Libya Stabilization Conference in Tripoli, the Beba supported the holding of a national election on December 24th as envisaged in a UN-backed peace plan. The election, agreed under a UN support peace process, has been held up as a key step in efforts to end the decade of violence by creating a new political leadership with legitimacy is widely accepted. Wrangling over the constitutional basis for an election, the rules governing the vote and questions over its credibility have threatened to unravel the peace process. The UN's Under Secretary for Political Affairs, Rosemary de Carlo, and Libya envoy Jan Kubis attended the conference. Libyan Foreign Minister has earlier said that her country and the United Nations have been striving to turn the page on the violence that has racked the country since 2011.